Now I have a problem. I always forget to take my rubbish bins out on rubbish day. So now I'll show you how to use a blueprint in Home Assistant to easily work with your calendar to announce time for taking the bins out. So the first thing we need to do is make sure that we've got the calendar integration installed in Home Assistant. And once you've got this installed, all you do is you go and you create a event in your calendar for the rubbish bin takeout time. So what I've done is I've gone and set it up for Thursday evenings at 4 p.m. because that's what time I get home and I want to take the bin out. So I've gone in there and I've created a weekly repeating um, calendar event. Now, very importantly, this needs to be longer than 15 minutes. So I've just made mine an hour from start to finish. If it's less than or 15 or less, it won't work. So I've created the name rubbish in that event. Now, what we need now is we download the blueprint and then we go and we add it in as an automation. Now, if you have a look at this blueprint, you will see here that it can be triggered on a keyword. So I'm gonna use the keyword rubbish. Um, you have the option to add a trigger at the start or the end. I just wanna add it at the start. When triggered, you have the option, option to send notifications to multiple devices. This time I'm gonna show it one. And then you've got these action buttons. Now for some reason, other, the actions don't seem to be working with me. I've got an Apple iOS device, but I don't seem to be seeing those buttons at all. So if anyone's got this working, please let me know. All right, so the first thing we have to do is select our calendar. So you'll see there that I'm selecting Simon's calendar. And then we want to use the keyword in the calendar. So we're gonna check that there. The keyword that we're gonna use is rubbish. Just make sure you've got the caps and the lowercase all as it shows in your calendar. Now you can set an offset. So I might say I want it to send me the alert 15 minutes, half an hour, two hours before or after the actual off start or end of the calendar event. But I'm not worried about that. Global conditions, uh, into any conditions. So you might have some condition that you want if you're away on holiday or something, you don't want it to remind you. Um, for me, the um, start notifications, I'm going to do it on the start, um, but you could do it on the end of the uh, calendar invite if you preferred. All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm gonna be sending a notification to my iPhone. So that's Simon's iPhone. So I've selected that and the title is just going to be the event summary of that trigger and the message, the event description. Um, now I have enabled the action button here and I've put the, the action as done. Um, but for some reason or other, I can't see any action buttons coming through on my mobile phone. So I'm not quite sure how that is supposed to work and why I'm not receiving it. So I'm not worried about any of these other things. I go down, I press save, and now every single time that rubbish um, icon comes up in my calendar, it will send me a notification on my smartphone reminding me to take the rubbish out. Now do remember, you will need to have the mobile app installed, the Home Assistant mobile app, and you will need to allow motif, uh, automa uh, notifications on that. That's all from me now. If you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next week. Bye for now.